dear students myself dr ritesh kumar assistant professor department of geology government pg college ambala kent today we shall discuss about the topic <coughs> phylum protozoa protozoa the word protozoa is a come from greek protozoon words meaning first animal protozoa are unicellular may be multicellular eukaryotic organisms protozoa constitute a large group of about 65000 species most of which are harmless free living and hit and inhibits water and soil a few species are pathogenic in nature parasitize human and other animal causing hundreds of millions of infection in a, in the a air around the world this is figure showing the protozoa structure in the paramecium main character sketches of protozoa first character the protozoa body consists of only mass of protoplasm so they are called a cellular or non cellular animals habitat mostly protozoa are aquatic either free living or parasitic size most protozoans are in size of 1 to 10 micrometer long but blanitidium coli may measure 150 micrometer body body of protozoa is either naked or covered by a pellicel locomotion locomotory organs are pseudopodia or cilia or absent nutrition nutrition are holophytic like plant or holozoic like animals or saprophytic or parasitic digestion digestion is intracellular occurs in food vacuoles respirations respirations occur through the body surface osmoregulation contractile vacuoles help in osmoregulation <coughs> in most protozoa the cytoplasm is differentiated into ectoplasm the outer transparent layer and endoplasm the inner layer containing organelles the structure of cytoplasm is mostly seen in species with projecting pseudopodia such as amoebas reproduction reproductions occur by both sexual and asexual reproduction asexual are usually by binary fission sexually happen by conjugation nucleus nucleus may be compact with diffuse chromatin or vesicular with central or <coughs> eccentric karyosomes dna and peripheral chromatin rna respiration is mostly anaerobic main morphology features of protozoa protozoas are eukaryotic resemble two animal cells contain major cell organelles including nucleus mitochondria their organelles are highly specialized for feeding reproduction and movement the cytoplasm of protozoa are divided into an outer layer called ectoplasm and inner layer called endoplasm ectoplasm help in movement feeding and protections endoplasm houses nucleus mitochondria and food some protozoa have special appendages flagella and cilia that help in their movements fresh water protozoa have contractile vacuoles to pump out of excess water their shape may remain constant especially in ciliate or change constantly as seen in 
in amoeba. This is figure showing ectoplasm and endoplasm. The size of protozoa is arranged between 3 to 300 micrometer. Few ciliate and amoeba are larger enough to seem with naked eye. They are about 4 to 5 mm micrometer. Except sporozoites, all type of sporozoa are motile, either the flagella, cilia, or pseudopodia. Have eye spot that can detect change in light, respond to light, and learn by trial and error. This is the figure showing eye spot notation. Mostly protozoa feed on dead plants, animals, debris, while some tropophyoids feed on bacteria and algae. Parasitic protozoa feed on the fluids and tissue of their host, for example, plasma and blood cells. Some protozoa live in some symbiotic relationship with other plants and animals. Classification of protozoa. Protozoa are classified on the basis of their mortality and method of reproduction. They are classified into four main types. First one is the flagellate, second one the ciliate, third one the sarcodina, fourth is the sporozoites. First is the flagellate. Flagellate move by help of flagella, a tail like structure. The movement is whip like for example of flagellates are trypanosoma leishmania blood pathogens gyria intestinal parasite trichomonas reproductive tract pathogen second ciliate ciliate protozoa have movement through cilia fine hair like structure attached with their body some protozoa have special kind of cilia for feeding and attachment. Most are, are harmless. Only one species, Blanitidium coli, is pathogenic for human causes a rare and server from dysentery. This is the figure showing in the ciliate contractile vacuoles, food vacuoles, micronucleus, micronucleus, oral groove, mouth pore, gullet, anal pore, contractile, vacuole, empty and cilia seen. This is the figure. Third is the coelophora. Complex freshwater or saltwater protozoans. It swims by the coordinated beating of their cilia. Nuclei is of two types. First is micronucleus and second micronucleus. Body is covered by pellicel. For example, paramecium. Rhizopoda. This is the picture showing. These are amoeboid organisms that produce false pseudopodia. It preys on fungi other protesta and small invertebrates reproductions by mean of sexual and asexual mostly free swimming some are parasitic for example amoeba u mystigophora it is characterized by one or more flagella free living or parasite body covered with cellulose chitin all silica sexual reproduction occur by longitudinal fission for example trichosoma sarcodina major locomotors organelles in sarcodina is pseudopodia pseudo means false podia means foot common example of sarcodina is amoeba most species are harmless and amoeba is a parasitic for human causes 
intestinal disease. Sporozoites. Sporozoites are the only non-motile form of protozoa. Sporozoites have well developed sexual and asexual stages. Entire group is parasitic in nature and are harmful. Some common examples of sporozoites and their infections are plasmodium. On the evidence of malaria causes 100 to 300 million infection worldwide. Toxoplasma condi causes toxoplasmosis. This is the figure showing the sporozoa, commonly parasitic on vertebrates, animals, locomotory organs, and contractile vacuoles are absent. Body covered with pellicel excessively and operasite reproduction by means of asexual and sexual. For example, plasmodium. Reproductions in protozoa. Protozoa can reproduce their offspring by both sexual and asexual methods. Asexual method of reproductions are budding by deficient cytogony or multiple fission. Sexual method in the conjugation and gametogony. Cytogony. It is the method of multiple fission in which first the nucleus undergoes multiple divisions form many nuclei that a small portion of cytoplasm concentrate around each nucleus and then protozoan cells is divided into many daughter cells. Cytogony, this is the figure showing first is the nucleus and multiple metastases and then cyto joints then mero joints and cytokinesis cytokinesis means cell divisions sexual reproductions conjugations two protozoa meet together and exchange their genetic materials gametogony union of two sexually differentiated cells disease cause protozoa first disease and causative agents malaria malaria cause in the plasmodium as plasmodium this is falciparum plasmodia oval plasmodia vivax plasmodia malariae second is the disease gaidiasis diarrhea Gaidia intestine analysis. Third is the amoebatic dysentery, Entomoeba histolytica. Fourth, toxoplasmosis, immune deficiency, toxoplasma, gondii. Fifth, cryptosporidiasis, cryptosporidia. Sleeping sickness, trypanosoma, gabinensis, and Lashmania, Kalazar, Lashmania. Main economic importance of protozoa. Protozoa are classified into two types based on their activities. First is the harmful protozoa and beneficial protozoa. Beneficial protozoa. Food. Protozoa provide food for insect larva and worms which are taken by fishes and crabs and which are eaten eaten by man second insect control several protozoa control harmful insects by persisting their body helpful in sanitization a large number of protozoa living in a polluted water feed upon organic matter and thus purify it oil Explorations. Petroleum is the organic origins. The skeleton deposit of formina fora and radiolaria are often found in association with oil deposit. 
in this means they help in the exact location of oil scientific study many protozoas are used in biological and medical researches harmful protozoa pollutions of water drinking water in natural conditions is made unplatable by the reproduction of some free living protozoa in it second destruction of wooden articles some flagellated like trichonepha and colony nepha live in their gut of termites and help in their cellular digestion reproduction reductions and fertility of soils protozoans feed on nitrogen mixing materia thus reduce the fertility of soils anti protozoals drugs example of anti protozoal drugs includes chloroquine mefloquine and perimethine methamine these are used in malaria treatment metro nidazole was developed as an anti protozoal drugs it induces stand breaks in the dna of sensitive organisms and helps disrupt membrane integrity other anti protozoal agents are sulfamides and trimethoprim inhibit folic acid synthesis this is thanking you so students this is all about phylum protozoa